align with the vision of His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, Vice President and Prime Minister of the UAE and ruler of Dubai and the Dubai Plan 2021, Dubai Electricity and Water Authority presents the Infrastructure NOC Technical Manual to firmly position Dubai as a world-class city in infrastructure projects and developments. The manual will act as an authentic resource and reference to help you to understand better the technical criteria related to the infrastructure work within right-of-way and Dubai Electricity Water Authority, in short, DIVA reservations. Learning to use the manual will assist you to swiftly obtain your NOCs from Infrastructure Information and Permits Department IIMP, in a transparent and hassle-free manner. This manual, as a technical reference, has gone through a rigorous internal review process involving 15 departments within DIVA together with its stakeholders. Their comments and recommendations are incorporated in the manual. The manual was developed on some standard principles such as all indicated clearances and protection details at the minimum dimensions unless otherwise mentioned. If you're not able to conform to the standard requirements, the closest case will be followed, keeping in view the site conditions. In this case, the concerned departments at DIVA will collectively study the NOC application on a case-to-case -case basis. Any NOC type not covered in the manual will be studied considering the site conditions and accordingly appropriate action will be taken. No one holds the right to deprive any party to utilize their services or utilities within their dedicated corridor. The manual covers 50 types of project NOCs supported by CAD, 3D technical drawings, site photographs, notes and tables. Typical project NOCs are categorized into four chapters. Each chapter has a unique color code. Chapter 1 – Utilities And its color is red. Chapter 2 – Roadworks Its color is gray. Chapter 3 – Structures Its color is blue. Chapter 4 – General Projects And its color is green. Every NOC is unique Therefore, the manual is uniformly structured. Each NOC contains introduction, avoid the following, standard clearance and protection details. This structure is uniformly followed across all project NOC types. While reading the manual, you should pay attention to the standard clearances and protection details, because this part will contain the majority of the details that you might be looking for. It has four tables that stipulate for you the horizontal clearances, vertical clearances and protection details with respect to the proposed work and existing DIVA services. You will also find that the remarks are interrelated to the technical drawings. The entire manual has been developed in a consistent way for you to easily refer, therefore you will always find Table number one represents LV cables. Table number two represents HV services. Table number three represents EHV services. Table number four represents gas fuel pipelines. Let's go through the process of extracting details from a project NOC. Ensure your starting point should always be the content page, where you can select your proposed project NOC. Let's take project NOC 4 via page 51 as an example. As you can see, each project NOC starts with an introduction and then avoid the following. You can decide on the details you need as per your requirements. If you need details for LV cables, then you need to proceed to table number one. Similarly, if you're looking for HV services, you'll find all the required details in table number two, and so on. Let's look into table number one. All tables have details of the horizontal and vertical clearances, in addition to the protection details required to protect the existing services while proceeding the activities for the proposed works. 
The table shows the proposed works in terms of whether it's allowed to cross the existing DIVA services or not. In case the crossing is allowed, the crossing position and method of crossing are indicated in the table. And under each table, there is a table for abbreviation. Moreover, it's very important to carefully read the remarks because they are interrelated to and complement the drawings. In table number one, the remarks steered us to review figure number 4.1, which is for the horizontal clearance. As you can see, the red dimension is indicating the required horizontal clearance. You need to address it in your NOC application. The horizontal clearance is measured from the edge of the proposed trough to the edge of the existing services, which, in this case, it is the LV cables. You can see it's one meter and you need to abide by it. Please make sure you have carefully read the notes for each technical drawing to understand all details as these notes and drawings efficiently complement each other. Similarly, figure number 4.2 demonstrates the vertical clearance. As you can see, it's 0.5 meters and it's measured from the top of the cover of the trough to the bottom of the existing services, which in this case is LV cables. Please do not forget to read the notes for the appropriate understanding. In light of this example, now you can follow the same procedures to extract the required details from other tables and drawings for the whole manual. This manual has been adequately benchmarked for making it extremely reader-friendly, and this video attempts to showcase that. The Infrastructure NOC Technical Manual will help your operations to seamlessly progress. Use it to verify and to ensure compliance to the stipulated technical requirements in order to prepare and submit your NOC application to DIVA's IIMP department. We wish you the best for your project and together we can continue scripting Dubai's success story to meet the vision of excellence of our leaders well supported by Dubai Electricity and Water Authority. Thank you.